Well, we live so far north that you know we don't really realize what's going on down south with these uh, TV programs. You know, the only time I noticed uh, that it was you know people are watching this is when I was down in Edmonton. People kept coming up to me and asking me about it. Well, I was in the hospital with my daughter there, and there was about 15 people come up and talk to me. And I was at a car show, and same thing. There was 15 or 20 people come up, discuss the show, and what did they say to you? Oh, you're one of the ice pilots, they'd say. You know? So we'd talk for, you know, half an hour or so and 15, 20 minutes. And same thing, I was in a Costco there in Edmonton shopping. I had about 10 people come up to me there, too. So I guess the show is popular down south. It's a pain in the butt a lot of days, you know. But it's not too bad. It's okay if there's, you know, it's not creating unsafe uh, situations, you know. Well, I'm not a movie star, so I don't like it. <laughs> I tolerate it. We get a little bit of conflict from uh, customers and the TV crew when everybody wants to go on the airplane. Eh? So that is a little frustrating at times that way, you know, because I'll have the camera could tell me, well, we're supposed to go, and I'll have the customer tell me, no, we don't want him to go because that takes away some weight. So it does cause the odd bit of problem uh, for the crews now and again. Well, it gives them, you know, nationwide advertising for basically free, eh? So it's should be good for Buffalo. Mikey will sell a lot of t-shirts. <laughs>